you guys. Um, just again, just to thank you guys for coming through to this uh, press briefing. Without wasting any time, I'd like to hand over to Cricket South Africa CEO Tabang Mora, welcome. And also to Darren Tucker, Vice President of New Balance Athletics Inc, uh, Asia Pacific. Tabang, over to you. Can you just please uh, briefly explain why we're here today, uh, this important announcement that you and Darren want to maybe announce? Uh, th thanks, KK. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Uh, welcome to our uh, Standard Bank Pro Tiers men's team, uh, to the uh, Pro Tiers women's team. Uh, welcome, guys, uh, the CSA staff, uh, members of the media, and uh, obviously our partners from New Balance. Uh, welcome, guys. Um, today we're here to celebrate a momentous day for us as uh, Cricket South Africa, uh, where our partners, New Balance, have indicated you know, um, that they have been very happy with the partnership that we've had over the years and that uh, they would like to extend uh, the partnership uh, by another five years. So we are here basically to renew the partnership between us, uh, to take us uh, to the upcoming World Cup and obviously uh, to the next one, which will be in 2023. So we as Cricket South Africa are in a pretty good space in terms of uh, the partners that we have in New Balance. The relationship has been a pretty positive one for us as Cricket South Africa. Uh, we've benefited a lot by partnering with New Balance. And one can only hope, Daryl, that uh, you guys have also benefited as much as we have, if not more. Um, but um, as Cricket South Africa, really, uh, our teams have been very happy with the kit that has been given to them. Uh, I know for, so, for sure that my staff has been happy as well in terms of the VIK they've gotten. Some nice shoes that Clive keeps throwing our way every now and then. Um, so please Clive, don't uh, stop those, keep them coming. Um, so without further ado, maybe I should give to Daryl, but essentially we're here to renew this partnership and to celebrate the future that uh, we are, but we're gonna, we continue to build between us and New Balance. Yeah. Um, just over to you if I can maybe ask you what has prompted you to continue this relationship with Cricket South Africa. Yeah, just to reinforce to Bung's words, I mean, the partnership's been very beneficial from a New Balance point of view. It's certainly helped uh, grow the presence of our brand in, in your great country. Um, I think when you talk about what's happening, not just for the men's and women's game, but the way Cricket South Africa is actually investing in the community and, and growing, I'd say, the awareness of the games through the community is very important to us. And the work that Corey's team does through the hubs and the product giveaways that we're enabled to sort of get to kids who maybe wouldn't get to play with the quality of product is very important to us. So that relationship or that um, initiative has very, been very important. We've certainly got a strong tie-in with, with Cricket South Africa or Cricket in South Africa um, from the start of our cricket business. And um, Dale Stain was, I'll say, the foundation member of our bowling team and helped us build our first bowling shoe, that was very important for us. Um, our, our cricket product manager is actually based down in South Africa, so we spend a lot of time here, I guess, developing and learning um, to help improve our product. So we have a great relationship, not just with Cricket South Africa, but with the game down here. And um, we very much look forward to the next five years of hopefully improving what we currently supply to the teams, but also enjoying some um, I'll say a much needed win in the next World Cup. Yeah. Um, Darren, you mentioned just a yeah, to forget, um, because you mentioned that you've got a few of the pro tier players under your stable. Would you say that has made it easy for you to continue this relationship concerning the amount of players that you're already under your stable? Well, they're in the room, so I wouldn't say they make it easy for us. <laughs> <laughs> um, but now, certainly having world class players working with our brand always ensures that you're on top of your game and ensures that you're developing or improving either ahead of what's going on in the marketplace or at least keeping up. So the guys have been great partners for us. I mean, I'll say great friends of our brand and the relationships have been very strong and the South African business from a New Balance point of view have built great relationships with them as well. And I hope the service and that they get truly represents what the days of New Balance are. And, uh, we appreciate having them part of our family and we appreciate being part of theirs. Yeah, thank you. So I'm just uh, lastly from your side, in terms of how great this uh, relationship has been over the years, and now looking forward to 
hopefully uh, the World Cup this year and in 2023, as you mentioned, in India. I'm sure from cricket side, from standpoint, you're very excited about it. Yeah, definitely. It all is well for us as Cricket South Africa to have a partner of this magnitude, you know, um, renewing their partnership with us. And um, as Cricket South Africa, we're very blessed as well to have the type of athletes that we do in, uh, in terms of how they carry themselves uh, professionally. And um, to be quite honest, um, I don't even remember a single moment where our team had to complain about the quality of kit that they received. So the standard of kit that New Balance has um, you know, produced for our athletes has been of superior quality. And as you know, uh, we play in different conditions from one country to the next. And the guys have been happy with how you know they can easily just play in the same kit from one country to the other, uh, in terms of how um, it, it helps them acclimatize, you know, um, in extreme hot conditions and the cold conditions. So they've been very happy with the kit uh, prov uh, provided to them, and um, we're just looking to grow this relationship further and further. And as I said earlier, that um, you know, we have benefited a lot as cricket South Africa. And uh, we will continue, obviously, uh, working hard on the relationship to make sure that New Balance as our partners continue to benefit as well. So it's a very um, wonderful thing for us as Cricket South Africa, and as I said, a feather in our cap. So we're pretty happy and excited. Right. Members of the media, without wasting any time, I'll uh, give an opportunity to you guys to ask questions to the CEO and to Darren Chaka from New Balance. Any takers? Yeah, Zayn? Uh, when the New Thank you. I, I believe the launch of the World Cup jersey will be around mid-April, um, is basically what we're working towards. When does it arrive in the country? That's probably a, a secret, but it's not too far away. So product will be around soon. I think the date's being worked out pending the departure of the team and, and how that flows. But yeah, around April or early May, I believe, is when it'll be launched. Any other questions? Everybody safe to say that this is probably the easiest press conference you've done in a while, time. Yeah. So yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, thank you very much, guys, for coming through. Um, just one last thing that we need to do. I'll just ask the two gentlemen of state to just sign a contract and make it official for Cricket South Africa and New Balance. Thank you very much for coming through. We're going to all the photographers. There's going to be a photo opportunity with the with the players as well here in front, uh, just after the contract has been signed. So I'll kind of ask if a few of the Pro Tools players if they can come forward as well, just to join Taban and Darren uh, in a photo opportunity. Club as well as Catherine, if you guys can come through, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you very much and good afternoon. Let me just remove these chairs. <laughs> Thank you.